Hello children, a very good morning to all. I hope you are all fine and safe at home. Okay, shall we see our today's class? Yes. So first we are going to see table. Okay. Today we are going to see nine table. Okay children? Yes. Listen carefully. One nine is nine. Two nines are eighteen. Three nines are twenty-seven. Four nines are thirty-six. Five nines are forty-five. Six nines are fifty-four. Seven nines are sixty-three. Eight nines are seventy-two. Nine nines are eighty-one. Ten nines are ninety. Shall we recall the second children? Yes. Listen carefully. One nine is nine. Two nines are eighteen. Three nines are twenty-seven. Four nines are thirty-six. Five nines are forty-five. Six nines are fifty-four. Seven nines are sixty-three. Eight nines are seventy-two. Nine nines are eighty-one. Ten nines are ninety. Okay, children. Fine. You have to write two times in your class work. Okay. You have to practice the nine table and write two times in your class work. Okay. Fine. Now we move on to the chapter. Today we are going to see a new chapter: shapes. Okay. Chapter six: shapes. Okay. First we are going to see plain shapes. Okay. We have two types of shapes. One is plain shapes. And another one is solid shapes. Okay, in plain shape we can say as a two-dimensional shapes. Okay, in solid shape we can say three-dimensional shapes. Okay, we already heard of two D and three D shapes. So plain shapes is called as two-dimensional shapes. Okay, that is two D. Solid shapes is uh, is known as uh, three-dimensional shapes. Okay, that is three D. Okay, three D shapes. Okay, children. Yes, fine. See, these are all plain shapes. What shape is this? This is triangle. Okay. What shape is this? Triangle. Okay. So in triangle, this is the corner. Okay. This is the corner, and this is the side. Okay, children. So we have one, two, three corners in triangles. Okay. And one, two, three faces. Okay, we have three faces and three corners in triangle. Okay, fine. Next one. See, next one is this is square. Okay, this is square. This is the corner, and this is the side. Now tell me how many corners are there in square? One, two, three, four. There are four corners in Uh, square. Okay, so four corners and side. One, two, three, four. So four sides. Okay, in square we have four corners and four sides. Next, what shape is this? This is rectangle. Okay, now tell me how many corners are there in rectangle? This is the corner. How many corners are there? One, two, three. Four, okay. So four corners and sides. One, two, three, four. So sides also four sides. Okay, children. Yes. So what is the difference between square and rectangle? In square, all the sides are equal. Okay. In rectangle, only opposite sides are equal. Okay, children. See here you have a. Puzzle. So this is see children. This is a puzzle. Okay. So this is a rectangle shape. Okay. In rectangle shape, only the opposite sides are equal. Okay. This is square. Okay. So in square, all the four sides are equal. Okay. This is the difference between rectangle and square. But corners and sides and all equal. Here also we have. Four corners, okay. See four corners and four sides. In rectangle also we have four corners and four sides. 
Okay, clear? Yes. Now we move on to the next shape. See what shape is this? Circle. Okay, here we don't have any corners and any face. Okay, so this is the, this has been drawn using the curved lines. Okay, so this is called circle. Okay, next one. So this is the pentagon. Okay, in pentagon, how many corners are there? Shall we count? Yes, see here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So there are 5 corners. And how many sides? Shall we count the sides now? Yes, see here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 5 sides. Okay, 5 corners and 5 sides. So this, this name is, this shape name is pentagon. Okay, children? Yes. So these are all plain shapes. Okay. Now we move on to the exercise. Exercise 6.1. So here they have given, you have to notice some objects in your home and draw the outline. Okay. You have to draw the outline of the particular object and write the name of the shape as well as name of the object. Okay. So see first I have drawn the circle. Okay. This is the Band picture. You all have seen bangles in, at your home, right? So this is the outline of bangle. And the shape of this is circle. Okay, children? Yes. Here I have drawn the outline of TV. Okay? You all have seen TV at your home, right? Daily you are watching. Yes. So this is the outline of TV. And the shape of this is rectangle. Okay, like this, you have to find some objects at your home and draw only the outline, not full picture, only outline you have to draw and write the name of the particular picture. Yes, fine children. Next, we move on to solid shape. Okay, as I have said, or said already, solid shapes means three dimensional shapes. Okay, see the first one, what shape is this? This is cube. Okay. What shape is this? This is cube. Here you have corners. Okay. How many corners? See corners as well as you can see vertex. Okay. Vertices or vertex. Okay. So corner as well as vertex. Okay. How many corners are there? In cube we have 8 corners. Okay. Next edges. How many edges are there? 12 edges. Okay, so here you have 12 edges and face. How many faces are there? 6 faces. Okay, in cube we have 8 corners, 12 edges and 6 faces. Okay, children, in uh, plain shapes we have only corners and sides. But in uh, solid shapes we have corner, edges, faces. Okay, next one. So what shape is this? So this is cuboid. What shape is this? This is cuboid. Okay. Here we have how many corners or vertex? H. Okay. Here also corner and vertex is H. And edges are 12. And faces is 6. So both are same. Right. Only the shape can be different. Okay. But the corners, edges, faces both cube and cuboid are same. Okay, children? Yes. Next one. Sphere. Sphere. You all have seen ball, right? You all play. So that is the sphere shape. Ball is the sphere shape. Here you have curved surface. Only one curved surface. Okay? That is the sphere. Next one. Cylinder. You all have seen cylinder at your home, right? For uh, gas we will use cylinder. Right? Yes. So this is the shape of cylinder. And you have plain face. Okay? Two plain face. Here and here. Two plain face and curved surface. See? Only one curved surface. And curved edges. You have two curved edges. Here one and here one. Okay? There are Two curved edges. Okay. So this is a plain face. Okay. This is these two are 
plane phase and this is the curved surface and this too is the curved edge. Okay children, next. Cone, okay. You all have seen a cone, right? Where you have seen in a ice cream or birthday cap, okay. You use birthday cap, no? So there you can find cone shape, okay. So this is a cone shape. And here if you have only one vertex, that is corner, okay. Only one corner you have, okay. Next, curved surface. So this is the curved surface. Curved surface also you have only one. Next, curved edges. So this is the curved edge. We have only one curved edge. And plain face. This is the plain face. So we have only one. Okay. So this is the solid shapes. Okay. You should know the difference between plain shapes as well as solid shapes. Okay children. Yes. Fine. Okay children. Now we move on to the next exercise. Okay. Exercise 6.2. Match the shapes to the objects given below. Okay. Here they have given the name of the shape. Okay. Here they have given the object. We have to match it correctly. Okay. See the first one. First one is sphere. Now tell me. Now find out here which object is in sphere shape. Yes. It is ball. So this is the first one answer. Okay. So ball is in sphere shape. Okay. Next one. Cylinder. Now find out the answer here. Which object is look like cylinder shape? Yes. Candle. So this is the second one answer. Okay. So candle is in the shape of cylinder. Okay. And the last one. It is cone. Okay. So this is the answer for cone. What is this? This is ice cream. Okay. Ice cream is in the object of cone. Okay. Fine children. Like this you have to match it in your textbook. Okay. Next one. Write the names of these solid shapes in the blanks. Okay. Solid shapes. Okay. Find out the name of the solid shape. See the first one. What is this? This is ice cubes. Okay. So ice cubes. So it is in the shape of cube. Okay. It is in the shape of cube. Okay. Next one. What is this? Ice cream. And it is in the shape of cone. Very good. So it is in the shape of cone. Okay. Next one. What is this? This is some object. Okay. So what is the shape of this object? Yes. Very good. Cylinder. The shape of this object is cylinder. And the next one is something looks like a gift box. Okay. So the shape of the gift box is cuboid. Okay. So you should know the difference between cube and cuboid. Okay. So this is all the sides are equal. But in cube, cuboid only the opposite sides are equal. Okay children. Fine. Next one. Okay children. Now we move on to the next exercise. Exercise 6.3. Who am I? Okay. So the first question. I have only one curved surface. I have see only one curved surface. This is a curved surface. Okay. So what shape is this? Yes, this is a sphere. Okay. This is not a circle. Here they ask to here they are asking one curved surface. Okay. If it is one curved face means that is circle. Okay. One curved surface means that is Okay, here the answer is sphere. Next, I have two circular plane face. Okay, I have two circular plane face. And one curved surface. So, one curved surface. I have, what shape is this? Yes, cylinder. Okay children, two circular plane face and one curved surface. I am a cylinder. Okay children, yes. Next, I have one circular plane face. Okay, I have one circular plane face and one curved surface. 
surface. So one curved surface. I am a what shape is this? Very good. Cone. So one circular plane face and one curved surface. I am a cone. Okay. Next one. I have six equal square faces. Okay. Six equal square faces. So if it is equal square faces means what shape is this? What shape is this children? Yes, this is a cube. Okay. So I have six equal square faces. I am a cube. Okay. Fine. Next slide. I have six faces. Three pairs of two equal rectangular faces. Okay. I have six faces. Okay. So I have six faces. Three pairs of two equal rectangular faces. Now tell me what shape is this? What shape is this children? Very good. This is cuboid. Okay. So if it is square means that is equal square means that is cube. Okay. But here they are asking rectangular faces. Rectangular faces means that is cuboid. Okay children, like this you have to draw and find out the name of the solid shapes. Okay children, fine. You have to write all the answers in your textbook. Okay, I will see you in the next class. Thank you.